Hello everyone and welcome to Neat Mentor. Uh, here we will talk about the updates about uh, the current counseling process. Uh, tomorrow is Sunday and uh, we are waiting for the seat matrix for All India Quota uh, in order to process uh, with the next step which is after registration. Registration is still going on and it will go on until 23rd. But those who have done the registration for them is a choi choice filling. And before the choice filling starts, they need to publish the seat matrix. Before seat matrix, okay, you need to know how many candidates. So there is an update from uh, state counseling, like Andhra Pradesh state counseling. And you can see here admission into the postgraduate medical degree diploma provisional merit list after verification of uploaded certificates under state quota seats. So they have mentioned state quota seats, it means it's for competent authority quota, means CAT A or you can say government quota seats in Andhra Pradesh. There was confusion among candidates that uh, my name is not there in the list and I registered for management quota. So for management quota they will be publishing separate, uh, separate uh, merit list, okay you can check your name there and uh, those who are for a competitive authority quota they can check their name there other state uh, Punjab also have uh, um, published their merit list okay so you can check the name there and uh, those who are coming under Sikh minority they had to do the verification process and you can check their your name over the list so when you check the merit list um, in order to uh, discuss about the changes in the cutoff Two factors are very important just before the choice filling starts. One is seat matrix, how many seats are there for the current counseling. Uh, and uh, other factor is the merit list, how many candidates have uh, participated for particular counseling. So the based on the merit list, the competition will be defined and based on the seat matrix, uh, competition on how many seats will be defined and accordingly uh, we can know what how will be the cutoff and all this time so you, you, you would see um, the number of candidates in cat e would be or cat b would be very high okay but uh, in the first round all the candidates will uh, go and take the seat but uh, in state counseling mostly from the round two okay you can expect the actual cutoff because in the first round, candidates used to participate in All India Counseling as well as in State Counseling. Um, and they join some of them, like those who are having good rank at the good top college, they will join in the first round because they are satisfied with the seat. And uh, those who uh, got seat allotted from a state round, they will leave the seat and the same, same seat will be coming in the round two. In round two, the competition will be lesser and in mop of round it will be further lesser um, but you have to see how many seats are left out so uh, next step is seat matrix and based on the seat matrix i will tell you the analysis like how many seats we have this time seat increment uh, can't be judged from nmc website because they used to increase the seat on daily basis but now they are not increasing so they have uh, actually left it over MMC, mcc uh, to upload the seat uh, last seat matrix and the approval process is already closed okay other uh, matters which are pending is ews nmc so nmc is ruled out at the national level in deemed university but that state level it may come okay but it's also possible that after it's notified by the state counseling authority that nmc is implemented in particular state counseling the private college body may go to the court against it as it uh, uh, as we shared in in the notification from a paper cutting in Madhya Pradesh that against uh, NMC the college management are going into the court so the matter will be on hold until the court says that go ahead with the previous rules and conduct the counseling and we will see the matter in the coming days okay so e doubles matter is also not uh, taken on priority in the supreme court they want uh, the counseling to proceed and it looks like last year supreme court uh, faced so many pil so many 
cases regarding the counseling and once upon time they mentioned that okay who is conducting the counseling and who has the responsibility either government or is supreme court okay this time they are not giving so much of priority to those court cases or pils and the candidate will uh, will throw less pils uh, due to this uh, uh, motive from the supreme court and the counseling will still proceed as per its uh, schedule for the next uh, exam neat pg 23 you will get this year sufficient time around 4 months of time after completion of the counseling and those candidate who got like mediocre rank and not satisfied with their rank they will mostly move for the next year you can also get benefit of uh, when the, they are going to complete their internship okay uh, if the candidates uh, the, free, the candidates who are who are um, doing the internship, if they don't complete the internship by defined time, once the brochure for NEET PG 23 will be published, okay, then you can judge like how much competition will be there for state level counseling. So all these matters, all these factors will play a role, and uh, the counseling is going on. So you have to keep a watch on all the things. Okay, I'll keep you updated with all the matters. Okay. Uh, through this channel so that's it from my side thanks for watching have a great day